Hi everyone, welcome to our channel. So today in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how do you use Upwork Time Tracker. So let's get into the video. So if you want to use the Time Tracker in the Upwork, uh, Upwork site, so first what you have to do, just get to the Upwork website and log into your account. So once you've logged into your account, if you want to access, if you if you need access to the time tracker, you need to see uh, you, you need your Upwork the desktop application in order to access the time tracker. So you need the desktop application in order to have, use the time tracker feature. So how do you get the desktop applications? It's pretty easy. So once you've logged into your Upwork um, uh, site, so just scroll down, scroll all the way down, and then you'll see an, an, an option called desktop app. So click on desktop app. All right, so once you click on the desktop app here, just choose the uh, choose the Windows version that your the, that your system is. Choose that and then click on download. And then once once you have downloaded, just install the application. So first do that. So you need the desktop application. So once you have installed the desktop application, for example, I just uh, installed mine. You should see something like this. So that's your uh, desktop application. So once you, once you have opened the desktop application, this is uh, when you open the uh, Upwork application, you will see something like this. So this is actually the time tracker. So as you can see, it says time tracker. So that's the time tracker. So how do you use that now? So now here, you need to you need to select the contracts. All right, you need to select the contracts uh, that you want to work on or that you want to track track for. So for example, uh, what you can do. So if you have your contract here, you just click on the refresh button here. Like for example, mine. I don't have an active contract, but you should, but if you have an active active contract that that you're currently working on, then it should pop up here. If it doesn't, just click on the toggle bar, the refresh button here. It should um, it should pop up here. Your active contract. So just select the uh, active contract and select the start uh, the active button. So and it it should track the time. So that's the so if you once you select the contract and then select active then it will start tracking the time so that's pretty much how you use it and then you can turn it off once you are done with it so that's pretty much how you like use this time tracker app on using the desktop application so hope this video is helpful to you guys i'll see you guys in another video thank you